Welcome everyone to this video channel, this video channel The Heart of Jesus is waiting for you presents and gives you heavenly love letters sent down to us then and now from our Lord Jesus Christ and from the Blessed Virgin Mary, so that we may prepare ourselves properly for the heavenly wedding of His Lamb God. Today we present the Word of God spoken by our Lord Jesus Christ in the Holy Monastery of the New Jerusalem of Romania, God's Word about the True Church Part 2 Refacet. Selection of Texts from the Word of God on this topic Excerpt from the Word of God on the Feast of the Presentation of the Lord, February 15, 2023, You bishops and priests who do not work for the glory of the Lord and have hidden yourselves with the evil work of the enemy Antichrist under the garb of the Church of Christ. Oh, the time has come for you to be brought to light through the Word of Christ, for behold, you you dare to oppress the flock, drive out the righteous from the church and work secretly in the service of the enemy Antichrist, for you love money and time, and your soul has been sold to strangers by God. Oh, humble yourself if you want, if you can, if you are left, we, the bishops of the Lord Jesus Christ, exhort you to repentance, for you work as adversaries. Oh, you have no right to rule over the righteous if you have taken high seats. The Lord is whole in every church and city through ministering priests, oh, and not you, but the Lord is he who has power over his church, behold. Do much abomination, and make the Lord's vineyard desolate, as it is written in the work of the hired shepherds. Oh, pull back from your fight with Christ, this is what we, the three bishops, Basil, Gregory and John, say to you. We command you from above from heaven this, and you will obey even if you want to, even if you don't want to, because this word is a word from heaven. You do not work for the Lord under the garment with which you cover yourself on top, and therefore let yourselves be overcome, and if your mind and heart can, repent and separate yourself from the work of the Antichrist man, who has filled the earth and found himself to hide under a holy garment so that his cunning and face as an enemy of Christ would not be suspected. Therefore, may the Lord rebuke you, Satan with the name of Antichrist, come out from under the holy garment and fear the name of God the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, and if you wear a human body repent on sight, because the Lord waiting for the salvation of sinners who call upon him for them, bless, Lord, the power of our word for your great glory over the Romanian nation and over your loving church in the midst of this nation, oh, how great is this earth and nation before you, and joy for all those in heaven is this truth. Sanctify the Romanians, forgive their sins, make them worthy to bring your coming and your glory with them and for them, and us, those in heaven, rejoice with your victory through the Romanian nation over the blackened by time Antichrist. The man of lawlessness, the fugitive who is hidden under a cunning spirit so that his evil work will not be known, but it is written in the pages of the scripture all his foolishness and all the shame he will have because he dared to raise blasphemy against Jesus Christ, upon God, maker of heaven and earth and man, and then of all things seen and unseen of God's making. Amen, you, Holy Fathers of the flock of my church from its beginning and until my coming again from the Father on earth, were true shepherds, lovers of God and his flock. You have left through my work with you all that my church would know and work on earth, oh, these are the pastors of my church. Listen to them until the end. You who remain faithful to the mystery of God through the church from the beginning laid on its foundation through the fathers. And those who give to change those set for eternity, let them be anathema. Amen, this is the end of today's message, may God bless you and keep you close to his sacred heart.